called Street Art and Graffiti in Birmingham kind of um, dropped off the scene a little bit for a while. Um, and then obviously with the kind of resurgence of people like Banksy and, and kind of it becoming a, a kind of popular and, and a cultural kind of change, people were kind of seeing it in a new light. It was definitely more started from graffiti and having kind of graffiti artists who were kind of going around and copying the kind of 80s New York graffiti writers and that sort of thing. Uh, and then I guess it just developed from there. Uh, I think all street art developed from graffiti in the first instance anyway. There's a real kind of mixture of artists and students and um, people like us who have got businesses who are kind of making, making artwork more than just uh, vandalising the streets really. This is something we completed, uh, but again, legally, uh, Birmingham and Digbeth especially is, is great for kind of artwork because everyone's really open to it and you can get a lot of permissions. Um, most of the artists that I know, they kind of just go into these factories and they speak to people um, and they just say, you know, can we, can we paint it, can we not paint it? If you want to kind of do something quite simple and, and something quite small that people kind of go out and they find and they look for and um, you can get a following that way or if you, you're into kind of doing like the bigger pieces and, and that sort of thing, especially with the internet and, and social media and that sort of thing, you can market yourself in any way.